what? No, the SEC charges 11 people in an alleged $300 million crypto Ponzi scheme. Why, it was what? just a... Who would have thought that cryptocurrency would have such kind of devious underbelly? Who would have thought of... <laughs> uh, who would have thought? Who would have thought a currency with no regulation would have... <laughs> <laughs> would have issues with regulation. Yeah, who would have thought? <laughs> uh, this is according to CNBC. On Monday, the SEC Commission, or uh, Securities Exchange Commission, the SEC, yep. said it charged 11 people for their roles in creating and promoting a fraudulent crypto pyramid scheme and Ponzi scheme that raised more than $300 million from retail investors, including in the United States. The scheme called Forsage... Uh, claimed to be a decentralized smart contract platform, allowed millions of retail investors to enter into transactions via smart contracts that operated on Ethereum, Tron, and Binance blockchains. Um... <laughs> what? <laughs> what? Yeah. Um, yeah. <laughs> I didn't I mean, want. I don't want to be the "I told you so" guy. I, I yeah. don't. But at the same time, I I hate crypto bro with a passion. Mm -hmm. Crypto bro is just the new gold. Is just the new gold bro. Uh, yeah. You know the the world's gonna go under. You gotta invest in gold. I'm not trading gold for food. Like yeah. Like if that's if zombie apocalypse is your fear, gold is the last thing on my list. Uh, <laughs> it's heavy. It's shiny yeah. and probably will attract things if you drop it. Like, oh yeah. <laughs> <laughs> well, zombie apocalypse is pretty worthless, but silver during a werewolf apocalypse that would, that would see, be something. See, but that's a different scenario. That's a different scenario. And altogether. that's and yeah. that's one the silver bros never planned for <laughs> either. They're not smelting it down into bullets and knives. They're <laughs> that's true. There's no. There's no. They're hoarding uh, forty nine quarters away. <laughs> That's that, they gotta they gotta create a new like uh, internet monster uh, where its weakness is cryptocurrency. <laughs> uh, you, you defeat it by putting it on the blockchain. <laughs> what about a blockchain MMO? I think they're I think they're actually working is on the, something like there? that. I think that they are. Yeah, <laughs> where I think we're like the items are like. The, the items are on the blockchain or something like yeah. that. So you, you know you have like a unique. Item oh wait, or no, that was just Diablo Immortal. Sorry. Oh yeah, yeah, yeah. <laughs> oh snap. yeah. Uh, Zachary says, "Craft uh, computing raid right on the blockchain. Your parody is stored in the blockchain. <laughs> 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 then you can go with NFTs are not a backup." <laughs> <laughs> no. <laughs> Bad. Bad. Anyway, Forsage, now that we're looping back into the, the news, Forsage was launched uh, back in January of 2020. Uh, and uh, cease and desist actions were first brought against the security uh, mm -hmm. in September of 2020. And later in March of 2021 by the Montana Commissioner of the SEC and Insurance. Wow. Um, so... Uh, despite this, and this is a direct quote from CNBC, uh, the defendants allegedly continued to promote their scheme while denying claims in several YouTube videos and by other means. So basically using social media to go, it's not true. It's fine. It's, it's totally fine. fine. This, this is just how business works and people are they're upset. Just, that blah, blah, blah. They're just jealous. Yeah. <laughs> yeah. <sighs> Told you so. <laughs> <laughs> Oh yeah, pump and dump. Yep. I also love it that every single time I talked about crypto on the show, I will get like four or five crypto bros uh, in my DMs the next morning telling me I know absolutely nothing about crypto and that I'm completely wrong on the claims and and they haven't, but a friend of theirs made like millions investing in crypto right. and and I should totally get on board with that. Um, that are the endless string of comments uh, that I'll the the AI bots trying to chat with each other, but none of their sentences actually make sense. Uh, yeah. yeah, but trying to promote whatever crypto they're trying to promote at the time. 